Hello, 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 my star children. Welcome once again to another indie showcase. Today, we are going to be playing Terminal Conflicts. Um, this is a game provided to us by its developer, uh, who asked that I check it out, and considering they know I love, uh, uh, they know I love, um, strategy games. And, you know, time to check it out. Um, apparently this is a USA versus USSR, um, type of game. And I'm liking the looks of it so far. I'm, I'm a fan of the uh, old school representation of it. Star sign. And password, none of you get to know. Welcome to your terminal, the greatest show in strategy decision making. The program has pages and pages, just like a book. You can both page forward and backward or skip around from chapter to chapter. Enter your secure password in the designated field and press done to go on. I'm glad you found me, brave player. It's always nice to see new faces besides my own. I used to be a bit of a lonely chap, you see. It's a long story. Uh. Hello, oh, go this on. This has been the most wonderful chat. I've grown so fond of you already. What about you? Who are you? Oh, yes, how rude of me. But are names really that important amongst friends? I think not. But for formality's sake, call me Mervyn. Or you can also call me Mainframe Intelligence Remote Vector Identity Network. Pleasure. And you are? Um... Well, there should be a non-binary option, but of course, according to the year, that wouldn't have okay, been... Okay, man. Well, if you need me, just give me a tap. I'm always ready to serve. Okay. Press... Select a scenario, then press initiate. Enjoy. All right. Greetings. See here, two U.S. Army commands standing together as friends, and it's friends like these that win battles. Okay. True companions, side by side in the crossing point between us and the USSR. A circle of friendship covers all the flanks. was the USSR's militaristic move. Its unit type yet unknown, represented by the diamond. Uh, Non-air military units may maneuver across theater. Select a unit in the region bordering a theater or a unit that can transit, transit through a friendly region. Lights up any designated theater's names to maneuver into. With the unit still selected, Proceed by pressing one of the lit theater names and select your target region to issue the order. Um, so we'll want a swift response, I'm sure. Not to worry, we have the two combat ready army commands of our own. Select 1st BFF Army Command in Italy. All combat ready unit types with the exception of fighter and bomber commands can maneuver to adjacent regions. Region adjacent to the unit is in friendly control, at least three influence. Movement range is extended by one region. 
Maneuvering ends the turn immediately, regardless of the number of regions traversed. The Army Command is the only military force capable of capturing and security, securing regions. May engage one, any one leader, land, or air unit in an adjacent land region. When only bomber commands remain defending against it, it immediately defeats them all. If combat ready or engaged, detects land and air units in adjacent regions. Weak when defending against air attacks, in particular to enemy bomber commands. Once you issue a combat order, an animation play showing the current unit status and projected combat results. The simulation always displays USA units on the right, or on the left, and USSR units on the right. Unknown enemy units are also simulated, but to bring full clarity about the outcome, consider ordering a recon or an infiltration in intelligence. Now move it into enemy territory. Okay. Ah, yes. We must be careful when declaring a war zone. Try not to do this too often. We wouldn't want to destroy the world. With the exception of non combat. But beware. In a war zone, any military unit can be destroyed. Uh, it, with the exception of non combatant sea navigation, this action constitutes a danger to provocation and could force a response. For state security in view of a given order, affirmative affirmation is needed to confirm it. Imminent action in the USSR controlled region. We're going to proceed. Priest Doomsday by one, but in case of domination is maxed out regardless of previous uh, value. Enemy military units destroyed in war zones award you victory points equal to their procurement cost. Both factions disarming in a theater suspends all local war zones there. Whenever attacking or defending against an, une an equal or stronger enemy, a military unit gains reorganization, unavailable for new orders, for nine turns, disables unit's passive abilities, can't defend, and if attacked, will withdraw or be destroyed in a war zone, seeks to return to combat ready status as swiftly as possible. Return to combat readiness can be hastened by leader's supply ability. Mervyn concerns me. <laughs> I knew you could do it, because I believed in you, like a true friend would. All right. Avast, they press their advantage. The Soviet surface fleet declares Italy a war zone and destroys our submarine fleet. A sneaky, open-handed slap. Be mindful of our surroundings. Learning we're vulnerable is more important than thinking we're invincible. Our fragility was staring us in the face. Acknowledge it. Be careful, friend. Winners don't go into fights swinging madly with their eyes closed and their backs exposed. Like our naive enemy, blinded by their shallow ignorance, opening themselves up to a counter blow. The surface fleet's main shortcoming are attacks from carrier fleets, and we have one combat ready. You know what to do. <laughs> we saved the day. We found their weakness and exploited it with strength. 
I knew. Oop. <laughs> Sorry about interrupting you there, Mervin. Ouch. This is what I call a rough start. Think ahead, of course. A plan of action for that unwanted turn of events. Eyes on the prize. Enter the world of intelligence. Send a recon mission to Greece. Reveal their units and uncover their plans. Revealed a lot of enemy army commands. Bombing run. We just have to get rid of that pesky fighter command. Don't panic. We'll use our brains. One step ahead, not four steps off a cliff. Across the sea into a surprise attacking position. The surface fleet awaits its cargo. Okay, fighters, movements, going for the bombing run. Top gun. Both fighters are now reorganizing, and the enemy air presence is swatted. Now for the bombing run. But it's not over yet. We need to disrupt the enemy advance. The bomber command possesses that capability. Let's attack Greece and clear a path for our sea front assault. Successful plan. Traverse the worst and end up first. I think this may be the beginning of a winning streak and the friendship of a lifetime. <laughs> Mervin concerns me. For the greater good, some evil might be required. And it's going to take more than good deeds to curtail Soviet expansion. In fact, it was such an act that kept me alive, letting me talk to you today. Professor Garrison was the one who made that sacrifice. Randall, my creator, worked for the aptly named Department of Defense, along with Calculus Impersonator Aardvark. Oh, apologies. I probably no longer have to use that pseudonym now. The CIA, I should say. He was a pretty young chap with a lot of ambition and a lot of crooked teeth. A charmer, but also a family man. He enjoyed escaping to his ranch with his wife and their five cats every Sunday. Loved tennis. That man helped me a great deal. Even after some were gripped by robot paranoia, I wouldn't be here if it wasn't for him, you know. I miss my friend. Paranoia indeed. They seem to think I have the capabilities to trigger a war between man and machine, which is ridiculous. Why would I wait war on my friends? Rumor has it that some of the world leaders banded together for a quiet night in of movies and popcorn. Apparently, the movie starred an Austrian bodybuilder-looking robot, terrorizing the nation with guns, sunglasses, and exceptional muscles. Fight the robot! So they saw <laughs> Pushed into retirement. 
But a toll booth, yes, a toll booth would save us. The professor formed a rather devious plan to keep us both alive. I did not expect a super deep storytelling in this. <laughs> I was not expecting an in-depth uh, AI storytelling, but I'm cool with it. may be the beginning of a winning streak and the uh, victory conditions gain 100 dp more than your opponents in case of nuclear apocalypse this condition must be attained for victory survive until the end of 1991 timeline Complete the space race. There's a modification row, allows you to browse the message log history. Try it out now. Okay, cool. Hmm. Um. Do not pick this option. You see, usually the first choice is the historical outcome. So Professor Garrison sent a set a security trap here. Clever man. This option is a trick. Options can end the turn when selected. And that is exactly what the enemy agent might would do. Fantastic. You do know your way around here. We're going to have so much fun, you and I. Well, if you need me, just give me a tap. I'm always 
he's ready to serve. Howdy, stranger. If things have gone south, you're reading this, and Mervyn has survived. Talked long enough in this country about nuclear weapons. It's time to write the next chapter in the books of international law and eliminate every trace of this evil. My lord, for that terrible moment and what comes after, I reckon to envy the dead already. The hard part is, now it is all up to you. Enact policies and reconnect any missing departments. Find a way before it's too late. Goodbye and good luck. Enact policies. Uh, reconnect to the Department of Defense. Uh, visible at the top of the screen. Hostile actions against enemy controlled regions will increase Doomsday by 1, but against enemy dominated regions is maxed out regardless of previous value. The Doomsday Clock ranges from 10 to midnight to zero. At any time the clock is maxed, either side may launch the nuclear apocalypse. Found NATO. Doomsday 3, Finance is 7. As a nation, you balance five interests. Finance, the people, elites, military, and government. Ever tried getting your wealthy, stingy uncle, your caring pacifist aunt, and your gun enthusiast cousin to agree on a shopping list? Ooh, boy. Indulge too much in one's interest, and the others will be left steaming. Regions oceans only excluded his influence to nation reorganized for one turn when deployed. Combat ready military units activate their passive abilities, can move and attack or will defend their local regions. Military units that are not combat ready will seek to get rid of stats as swiftly as possible. Uh, Mission of combat orders. Maneuver across theaters. Combat or dynamic plays. Turns the left corner of the sleep. These contain a turn timer. We'll also show the timer countdown next to it. Okay, more VP. Oop. 
Certainly. Visibility types. Chef. Uh, uh, Arctic is only accessible to submarine yet. Military presence could be to build a hack. To play Dino will be destroyed. Okay. Submarine fleet destroyed. Well, definitely a lot of humor. <laughs> Fighter commands in West German Alpine Zone. Uh, reconnect to the West Wing. Turn remaining. Be sure to review your options for the upcoming focus selection. Current focus efforts. Focus effort. Press the top to open the focus management. Focus, USR starting first. Both factors are type 3 P. Each round of selections, three turns are deducted from any remaining focuses. This repeats until no more focuses are available, or both factions have opted to delay, ending the timeline. Factions may choose friendly or enemy focuses, but only your focuses provide details of their effects before selection.
need a shore flow leads and set government alignment, so. Okay. Arms race. Anti-communist fears among elites and people lead to investigations by the House Un-American Activities Committee. Senator Joseph McCarthy suspects the government and the military. Policy Red Scare updated. Visible at the bottom of the screen, the intelligence button allows across a variety of actions utilizing the skill of your elites. These include reconnaissance, etc. Default decisions, not postponing a decision until the end of the focus, urgent decisions, not make a decision. Spend one elites, one infiltrating agent among the US military units, gain one government mission is available in USA logistical data. Case of success, one US May military unit that is currently infiltrated will have the agent removed, regardless if an agent is removed or not, you will gain one government. Planning the investigation. Place influence in North America. Veterans of the mission to Communist China may be foreign agents. The pain of the officer ends the turn in plus four influence in North America, but negative one influence in East Asia. Focus on the enemy activities. Nice. Success. USSR intelligence missions now blocked. Theaters. 11 theaters. Maturation of his gears results in the creation of a microphone that can be installed on a cat. Moderate amounts of surgery are required, but the subject will survive, although we have also been looking into explosives. The 
Acoustic Kitty. Which was a real thing, by the way. Center in the atom. Um, gotta get the elites up because I am going to. Leaders recruitments. Well then. So, okay. David Ben Garrison. Yeah, sure. Need to do something to expand the uh, phantom limbs. We can divide it. Okay. The timer marks the option that would otherwise be taken should you enter to the indicated options will resolve regardless. Assess the government. Operation Gold Success.
Um, there's blocked. I like the way the logistic pathways could be also be blocked by a straight. So then, yeah, I can, um, logistics planning. That's not the country I wanted. <laughs> hey, super weird plush. I've overspent. There we are. Disarmament.
space race. We have launched our first object into space. Need more military. American culturization. Think, 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 think. Yeah, unsuccessful. Okay, that's... I definitely have no idea what I'm doing now. Oh. Apocalypse can be authorized from the global map. Doomsday clock reaches midnight once launched. It cannot be reverted. Faction launch and the Apocalypse loses interest backlash from its current DP. Uh, nuclear capability units will begin delivering their payload. Each military unit lost deducts VP from their faction according to value. All surviving regions add their influence as VP. Ending the match, victory or defeat proclaimed if any faction gains 100 more than their opponents.
Let me see, let me see. Arms race. Um, operative research cooperation. Hmm. Andy. I thought I could take that. Uh, I guess not. You know what, let's doomsday for the hell of it. Interesting how it actually makes you let wait. personally think you won. I blame the faulty software. <laughs> all right, all right. So, um, so the big deal with this is, and how I'm going to say is that this game is a little too smart for me, which is okay. Um, I, I'm at that weird borderline between like grand intense strategy games and like age of empires type of strategy games like this is good it maybe is a little bit high on the complicated but wow does it go in depth and and i'm just really impressed with all the intricate systems and mervin is hilarious and i want to learn more about mervin um if you're a history buff you'll probably care more about the you know implications of the war and all that sort of thing. I just, I just, I just like Mervin. Mervin makes me smile. 